Okay, today we're going to show you how to purge uh, one of our 927s. This is applicable for any of the uh, high pressure uh, pumps that we have. You want to get all the gas out of the system. And so, um, to start with I have everything hooked up here. First thing I'm going to do is go ahead and pull a vacuum on it. This is the vacuum valve here, the vent valve here. I'm going to close that. And then I'm going to go ahead and bring it all the way out. I just set this up so I'm sure I have some, I'm sure there's, there's gas in the system that we, we need to get out. And then I'm going to open up the vent valve and push the screw press all the way in. This is now pushing any gas back out of the system. When I get to the end, you probably won't be able to see it, but there'll be some bubbles that you'll see come up. There's a few that come up in the cylinder there. Close this again. Now I'm pulling a vacuum. We should see a vacuum show up on show up on our gauges here as we do this. The goal would be to get down around 10 to 11, negative 10 to 11 psi which of course will depend on what your barometric pressure is. I'm going to do this three times. And then we'll generate full pressure. Okay, we're going to go ahead and purge this. Right now I have the vent open. I'm going to close it. Bring it all the way out. We'd like to see a vacuum around. As you can notice on the gauges, we're pulling a vacuum now. You want to see a vacuum around 9 or 10 PSI, minus 9 or 10 PSI. You may need to do this purge method three or four times depending on the system. Okay. Then I'm going to go all the way in. I'm going to close, I'm going to pull it out again, and then we'll open it back up to zero the instruments, and then we'll generate pressure. So when I'm doing this, I have that vent valve closed. That's important, because if I leave it open, I'm just bringing air into the system, and we, we don't want to do that. We want to get rid of the air. See on all the gauges we're climbing rapidly now. When you do these measurements, you want to go to about 80%, 70-80% of range, and then go to the we're using the main screw press and then go to the fine adjust.
need a lot for the abiotic effect kind of sink in but we can certainly generate 10,000 PSI